Kelty committing five up. They're obviously going right channel. Indeed, they are looking for Aggieman to Higginbotham. Ball over the top. That's a great save by Hogarth. And just under four minutes on the clock. The danger not away yet as Aggieman goes. And Aggieman does make the breakthrough. Well, the save only temporarily halted Kelty from getting that first goal of the game. Falkert will be disappointed. Four men round Aguiman, and unfortunately, nobody could block the shot. Falkert nil, Kelty won. No referee Fordyce either missed it or chose to let it go. As O'Ware steps out of defence, finds Higginbotham. Aguiman in support. He's gone bursting past Henderson. Chance to shoot, and it's number two. Aguiman with his second goal in four minutes and it's a terrific start for the visitors. Falkirk nil, Kelty two. For White to McCann again. Another cross in from McCann. Heather hits the post. The question is, did Jameson get a touch? Well, the officials say no. Have a look at that again. Good header at the back post from McKay. Kelty doing really well. That's a good layoff from Nesbitt to McCann. The early cross in. Well, met by the head of Gary Oliver, unfortunately. Plenty power, couldn't get a direction right. Tries to provide it. Wide to Mackay, the ball in. Falls to Oliver, the shot blocked. Out to Morrison. Shot to Allegria, chance to shoot. Unfortunately, one Allegria, the flag has gone up. The Colombian lost his footing anyway. It was a real chance. Game management about half an hour ago. Well, can't blame them. They are two goals up after ten minutes or eight minutes to be more precise. So Kelty do have the the right to play that way now if they want. They think the job's done, so they've basically just tried to shut up shop and hit on the break. And there's Lowe forcing a terrific save from Nicky Hogarth. You have to say a great stop by the on loan keeper. Yeah, a bit head tennis to begin with, but you see Nicky Lowe, we know he's got a shot in him. And great save from Nicky Hogarth. Manager John McGlynn suitably unimpressed with what he saw in the first half. It's a triple sub as Callum Morrison, Gary Oliver and Craig McGuffey make way for Finn Yates, Stephen Hetherington and Roman Burrow. If they can get one, you never know. Donaldson, Henderson, McGinn, Mackay. Well, in the delivery, very deep. Mackay helps it in to the back post, and Forster, unaware of what's around him, has to put it by his own post. Good takedown by Donaldson to Nesbitt. And Reese Peggy just stepping in front of Nesbitt to block the run. Yeats goes for the ball. Tids are delaying as much as he can. Nesbitt. Goes to the back post, flicked on by Henderson. The shot, and it's there! Falkirk have a lifeline! It looks like Juan Allegria got the final touch. The Colombian has given Falkirk hope in this game. His third goal in two matches. Falkirk one, Kelty two. Mackay opts to go route one, surprisingly. Allegria wins it back well. Allegria heads towards the byline. Decent cross in as well. And Ramarn Burrell with the effort beyond the back post. Well defended by Rhys Peggy. Donaldson stepping all the way out. Nesbitt, good delivery in. And that's a great defensive header. One Allegria denied. Well, the referee saying actually the last touch was Allegria. I thought the defender got a touch, but... And certainly use the ball a bit as well. Aguiman though goes bursting clear. Chance to seal it. And Hogarth does enough. A great save as Nicky Hogarth throws out a leg and deflects it wide. A big, big moment in this game. Low flights this one in. Good header away by Henderson. Shot, deflection, and then goal as Kelty make it three. The shot from the edge of the box from Lyon. Looked like it took a deflection on the way through. The question is off who? 
What can they do in the final 20 minutes? Hetherington wide to McCann. McCann against two, now against three. Still going. And wins the side a corner. He usually seems to be left as the, the last man, though, for Falkirk at corner kicks. Meanwhile, Nesbitt flights this one in. Henderson with the header flicked on by Burrell. The bundled home, and Falkirk once again are back in the match. Four went for it. It looks like Juan Allegria got it again. Let's have a look. Yeah, no, no it's Ramarn Burrell. 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 So we just need to use it. Brad Mackay with the long throw. Flicked on. Second header. Third header still going. Allegria, arms all over him. Aguiman eventually comes away with it and thumps it clear. McCann returns it as far as Hetherington. Sore one from Aware, surely a booking. Aware furious with Robbie McNabb. Must be a booking. It's not going to be a warning, surely. Has to be. Liam Henderson, I think, possibly. Liam Henderson standing over it, and uh, it's like Kai Kennedy, fully, maybe 25, 27 yards out. We need to follow up, though, Lewis, that's the thing. Kennedy steps up, uh, rising all the way from Kai Kennedy. No danger to Jameson's goal. One. Just trying to draw the foul, but it's Liam Henderson flicks on for Burrell. Shows Forster a clean pair of heels, the shot. A good save by Jameson. In the final minute, good hands from the Kelty keeper. Flighted in by Kennedy. Headed back in by Yates. And there is the final whistle. A little bit of after is going on. A fairly bad tempered match in the second half, you have to say. Falkirk certainly improved in the second half, Stuart, but unfortunately, the damage done in the opening eight minutes.